Three, two, one, go. And we're underway. This will be qualification match number 77. Blue Alliance comes out shooting. 17-47 on the far side of the field, joining up with the law. And 27-04 for the Blue Alliance scores. Red Alliance is out in front. It's 24-10 at this point. Now the team's starting to rock and roll as they maneuver into position. 45-89 appears to be having some challenges there. No movement from the robot just yet. They could be playing possum. This is a teleoperated period. Drivers now in full control. 639 backs away from the far side Red Alliance feeder station. Their robotic arm now maneuvering up and into position. They shoot and connect twice now for six points. Preparing to shoot again. Could be that they're a little jammed. You know, sometimes those discs get a little warped as robots drive over them. Now they free up those discs. The last two go in, adding 12 total points for the Red Alliance. In the meantime, the Blue Alliance has got a great machine out there. It's at the far side Blue Alliance feeder station. 2704 is the robot's number. They're shooting long range and connecting in the two-point goal. For the Red Alliance, it's 4067 trying to repeat that feat. The Incredible Hawk. They've got the range. They just didn't count on running into 2457 that's been blocking their shots and continues to do so. Now 4067 tries to run into him, pushing him out of the way so they have a better shot, but the law just won't budge. It's a close match thus far. Coming up on the 10 second mark, only three points separate these two great alliances. Final seconds. Red Alliance gets one of their robots to hang in 10 point range on the Red Alliance pyramid. That's it, this one's over. For match number 77, the final score 67-62 in favor of the Red Alliance. Three, two, one, go, go, go! And here we go, folks. 15 seconds of autonomous action. 33-10 for the Red Alliance leading the charge. 9-30, putting them in uh, 37, all in on the scoring drive. Red Alliance with 54 points after the opening period. Blue Alliance has 26. Teleoperated period now underway. And already we have a robot down. 21-37 got bumped by their Alliance partner. Now they're spread eagled out there on the carpet. Near side of the field on the left hand side. Action now shifts over to the Red Alliance side of the field. 33-10 shoots and scores their Alliance partner with them. That's 9.30. Bears able to connect on two of their four shots. Now they back away. Now we shift down to the Blue Alliance side of the field. That's 16.60. Using their rail gun to hammer home several scores through the three-point goal. Now we move back down to the Red Alliance side of the field. 9.30 is in position. Shooting mechanism is now engaged. It comes up, targeting system is on, and they're able to connect. Their alliance partner, 3310, connecting as well, helping to extend the lead of the Red Alliance. 93 to 38 with 50 seconds remaining. Now we switch back to the Blue Alliance side of the field. That's 3003 in position. That's the tanks, the great team out of Canadaqua, New York. Pushing and shoving match on the far side of the field, 36-27. The great defensive robot put together by the team from Sarasota, Florida, taking on all comers with 30 seconds remaining. 36-27 is latched on to the Blue Alliance Pyramid and now working to try to pull itself up. Still plenty of time left. Red Alliance with 108 points. Trying to put a little icing on the cake. 33-10, latches on, pulls itself up. That's it. Time has expired.
for qualification match number 78, 139 to 54. The Red Alliance comes out on top. Three, two, one, go. And we're off to a great start. Cheesy Poos for the Red Alliance, getting him up and in, earning six points for each one of the discord in the high center goal. Final seconds of the period. Blue Alliance trying to get something going. Period comes to a close. Red Alliance is out in front, 62 to 12. Team scramble now to reload their robots and then to move into scoring position. Here come the Cheesy Poofs. They outmaneuver 1967, pulling out to the base of the Red Alliance Pyramid, scoring three of their four shots for nine points. 34-67 for the Red Alliance, far side of the Red Alliance Pyramid. They shoot, but their targeting is off. Their Alliance partner joins them, however. They're able to connect. That's the Cheesy Poofs on the move near side of the field. They're able to pick up disc from the floor, load them into their machine, and now they make their way back out. Blue Alliance Robot 694 shoots and scores. Now maneuver to re reload their machine. And it's going to be 1967, the Jagsters. It'll be serving as the defensive robot for the Blue Alliance. Trying to hold the Red Alliance in check, keeping them out of range of their feeding stations. 3145 trying to climb up the uh, near side corner of the Red Alliance pyramid. It's in 10 point range right now. Their Alliance partner, the Cheesy Boots, continue to shoot and score. 30 seconds remaining now. All eyes shift to the blue side of the field. 25-43 shoots now. Titan bots trying to make a name for themselves. Now teams begin to try to hang on to the robot. 34-67, climbing all the way up into 30 point range. 31-45, trying to climb up the outside. We've still got plenty of time. Trying to get into 20 point range, two seconds. They are in 20 point range and time has expired. For qualification match number 79, 164 to 77, it is the Red Alliance. Three, two, one, go. We've got a robot movement. Team 51 was the first to move, but it's 868 that gets in and scores along with 801. 801 is an amazing robot. That robot was completely destroyed in an automobile accident and then rebuilt from scratch in less than 24 hours. Teleoperated period now underway. It's a close match thus far, 36 to 30. At the end of the opening period, Red Alliance is out in front, but the Blue Alliance looks to get something going. 126, they shoot and score for the Red Alliance, then race all the way down to the left side of the field on the far side to the Red Alliance feeder station to reload. Their Alliance partner trying to get in position. It's 172. They shoot and they connect up high, adding another three points. Now the action shifts to the Blue Alliance side of the field. Blue Alliance looking to keep it close, trying to narrow the gap if they can. 45-45 will be your defender. That's the Golden Knights, the rookie team. Their Alliance partner is 801. Unable to connect on their last shot, but they move away, trying to gather up another disc and hold the Red Alliance out of their feeding station. 868 shoots, but it was 51 that slipped in and blocked their second shot. Now 45 45 taking on 172. 172 trying to push him out of the way, but 45 45 is a great defensive bot, and the drivers for that alliance really know what they're doing. Keeping 172 out of shooting range. Now the two robots break, 172 at the base of the pyramid, nearest to our audience. They shoot and they score for the Red Alliance. Adding three points to the total. Their Alliance partner, 126, was able to connect once. 
Now 172 maneuvers back into position and shoots again. 51, far side of the field, that's a purple machine. They shoot and score one of the color discs at the top of the pyramid. Then they latch on for 10 additional points. That's it, time has expired. 159, 123, Red Alliance comes out on top. Three, two, one, go! The disc away, both alliances able to shoot and score in the opening period. Remember, any goal that's scored here is worth double points during the first 15 seconds of the match. Very evenly divided now, period comes to a close. 54 to 40 is our score, Red Alliance is out in front. Now there's a shoving match near center field. 2165 getting around Blue Alliance Robot 2604 to get to the feeder station. Blue Alliance Robots taking up a defensive position to try to hold the Red Alliance in check. 2590 lost its grip on one of the discs, loaded it back up again. The light show comes on and they begin shooting. One, two, three, discs go in. That'll be worth nine points through that center goal. Now we've got our eye on the Red Alliance team at 973, shooting and scoring now. While Red Alliance robot 23, check that, 236, begins to climb up the outside of the Red Alliance pyramid. Techno ticks on the move. 2165 shooting along with 973. They get a little tap from behind by 4810. Now two Blue Alliance robots are there on the near side trying to keep 973 out of scoring range. 4810 on the move, slamming into them, but they still get their shots off. Connecting for 12 points. 25-90 for the Blue Alliance. Able to connect during that exchange. All of their shots scoring through the three-point goal. Blue Alliance looking to keep it close with less than 20 seconds left in the match. Red Alliance now with 130 points. Looking to add to it. Now the Red Alliance with two robots hanging from their pyramid. And time has expired. For qualification match number 81, 170 to 94, it is the Red Alliance that comes out on top. Red Alliance earning 40 additional climbing points in the final seconds to pull this one out. Three, two, one, go! Here we go, folks. Robotic action of the autonomous mode here on the Archimedes field. Team 1100 with the last shot out. 1071 gets one more shot in before the buzzer. 36 to 18, Blue Alliance out in the front at the end of our opening period. Period number two, that's the teleoperated period now underway. Teams maneuver their robots into position looking for the optimum firing solution. Looks like the Blue Alliance 326 has found that location. That's the team that represents Romulus Community Schools. They've got a long range shooter Tends to be fairly accurate as well. Another shot, this one just a little bit short. Next one's a little high. Head referee is keeping a good eye on 321. Look like there might have been contact in a protected zone, but they cleared it. A lot of pushing and shoving there on the near side. And now 326 connects for two points. Red Alliance shooting now. 1071, far side of the field. And 840, another great long range shooter. Rapid fire going all the way. 
1836 for the Blue Alliance appears to be dead in the water. No movement there. Scores just keep on coming. 326. Connecting in the two point goal from long range. Now, folks, it's team 1100 grabbing onto the bar, pulling themselves up with about four seconds left in the match. Red Alliance with two robots in 10 point range. That's it. This one's going to be over for qualification match number 82, 86 to 63. It's the Red Alliance that will prevail. E, two, one, go! Red Alliance is gonna be the first to score, 15-19, leading the charge, Mechanical Mayhem. A Blue Alliance coming right back at it. Blue Alliance with 18, a Red Alliance with 34. Now we begin the teleoperated period, drivers at the controls. Very quickly maneuvering them over to the nearest feeder station so that they can reload and then come back out and take to the field. 46-37 on the move now. That's the rookie sensation out of Philadelphia, the Bambi Bots. They're at, the at the near side, Blue Alliance feeder station. 15-19 scoring from long range. They're at the Red Alliance near side feeder station, shooting all the way to the other end of the field and connecting in the two-point goal, helping to extend the lead for the Red Alliance. Blue Alliance robots now being reloaded at the far side, Blue Alliance feeder station, and out they come. 46-37, nosing into position now. Their Alliance partner joining them near the base of the Blue Alliance pyramid. Far side referee now throwing a flag on 4470. That's the rookie team out of California, Ty Gears, with the foul. Foul points will be awarded to the Blue Alliance. 2081 for the Blue Alliance on the far side of the field. They were able to connect in the three point goal. Helping the Blue Alliance to keep it close. Coming up on the 32nd mark, 97 to 78. Red Alliance still out in front. Still plenty of time as these teams begin to work their in game strategy. 44 70 now taking on 2081. 2081 trying to slip past them. But the Tigers playing them close. Now 2486 is latched on to the Blue Alliance Pyramid, pulling itself into 10 point range. Blue Alliance appears to have two robots swinging. Red Alliance has at least one. 130 to 104, Red Alliance will win it. Three, two, one, go! Here we go, folks. This will be qualification match number 84. Red Alliance comes out shooting. Blue Alliance able to connect as well. 1595, part of the scoring drive for the Blue Alliance. 469 does the same for the Red. At the end of our opening period, it'll be 30 to 10. Red Alliance out in front. Teleoperated period now underway. Now there's a foul on the first team, 8-12. Midnight Mechanics charged with the foul. Contact, I believe, in a protected zone. And now the Mechanics pick up another flag. Foul points, of course, awarded to the opposing alliance. 1595 on the move. Three of their shots go in. Last shot ran into the pyramid. Bounced off to the side. Action now shifts over to the Red Alliance side of the field. 469 shoots and scores. In the high center goal, picking up an additional three points for the Red Alliance. 42 to 29. 469 shoots and scores again. Los Gorillas, the team that represents the International Academy. Pause in the action now as the defensive struggle heats up. Now 1595, out the score. 
Several shots hit home in the high center goal. Each disc scored up there is worth three points. 63 to 40 now as we near the 30 second mark. Each alliance regroups, trying to work the strategy that they called for just prior to the start of this match. 469 now jets its way back across the field. From right to left, gathering up additional disc and then trying to move back into scoring position. Now there's a flag thrown against the Red Alliance team. It's going to be on 812 again, Midnight Mechanics. For match number 84, 117 to 59, it is the Red Alliance. Tres, dos, uno, vamos! And it's on. Shots fired. 10-11 led the charge. Now the rest of the Blue Alliance robots join in. Period comes to a close. We've got the Blue Alliance out in front, 20 to 15. Teleoperated period now underway. Drivers are at the controls. 4067 nearly fell over. Was able to regain its wheels. Now it's on the move again. Trying to take up a defensive position, holding 4501 in check. NASA machine is sandwiched between two Red Alliance robots looking for a way to get through. And in the meantime, for the Red Alliance, it's 948 shooting long distance and connecting all the way to the other side of the field. Now we've got 1011 down on its side. And the head referee over there counting that one out. So that means that the Blue Alliance is down a robot and they have an additional obstacle in the middle of the field that they're gonna have to navigate around. Red Alliance trying to take advantage of the situation. 948, that's NRG, continues to score. Now the Blue Alliance, led by Team 4731, the rookie team. They're shooting, trying to make up the difference now. They get slammed from behind by 1868. Space Cookies just trying to remind the Blue Alliance that they're still there. Coming up on the 32nd mark, Red Alliance out in front, 78 to 24. The Mexican team now comes to the near side of the field, trying to jet past the Space Cookies. The Space Cookies have one incredible machine, trying to keep them from being able to reload their robot. Final seconds of the period now. 45.01, the humans have grabbed onto the bar for the Blue Alliance and climbed onto the pyramid, hanging in the 10-point range. 110 to 39 in favor of the Red Alliance. Tres, dos, uno, vamos! All right, match 86 underway here. On the Archimedes field, red starting quickly, 1075, 21, 37. Blue, though, 30, 44, and 17, 14, firing back. We come out blue with a slight lead out of autonomous. Driver step to the controls. Robots immediately over to their loading stations to gather their discs. You can carry four at any one time. Twenty-one thirty-seven and 3008 on the far side of the field. 2137, torque, 3008, Falcons pushing and shoving as 3044 on the blue side. Team OXB4 able to score, put some points up for blue and extend that lead. Team 2137 loading, looking for some of the long shots across the field, trying to get that dialed in. They get that hit, every one of those hit is three points for the Red Alliance. Looks like they're dialed in, that's two in a row, see how many they can hit. 
30-44 on the blue side. Also scoring 17-14. More robotics out of Milwaukee going for the 30-point climb. We've seen them do it before. Blue starting to winch their way up. 40 seconds to go, match 86, 21-37. Parked in the loading zone. Remember, they are safe because they're in the safe zone. Firing one after another, scoring points for red. Less than 30 seconds to go, human players come into action. 21-37 continuing to fire. We will see 30-44 for blue doing the same, trying to score some last second discs. 15 seconds to go, is 17-14 going to make it? Could be the big difference in this match if Blue gets a 30-point hang. Looks like they're up with three, two, one. That's it, that's it for match 86. A couple long shots on the field, a 30-point hang for Blue. We'll see how the score shakes out. 75 to 53, the 30-point climb made all the difference for the Blue Alliance. Blue comes out on top in match 86. Three, two, one, go! Match 87 underway, two rookies squaring off. One on red, one on blue. 24-15, moving quickly for blue, but the Red Alliance not to be outdone. 26-14 and 29-59, firing back quickly for red. 24-15 now taking their turn, able to pick up more discs and score for the Blue Alliance. Blue looks like they came out big and autonomous, 48-18 to 18 as drivers step to the controls. 26-14, 29-59, immediately for Red getting loaded up from their driver's station. Meanwhile, 24-15, the Wired Cats out of Atlanta back to scoring quickly for the Blue Alliance. 29-59, now the Robotarians out of Michigan. Back-to-back -back shots, able to put three up and in for Red. Those are three points each in the top goal. 26-14, Mars out of West Virginia. Looks like they're getting lined up for shooting on the Red side themselves. 24-15, back to doing what they do. Underneath, parked under the blue goal, parked under the blue pyramid, into the blue goal, they score. 1 minute to go, 1 minute left, match 87. 24-15 dealing with a little bit of defense, able to get back underneath, safe touching the pyramid and able to score for blue. 29-59, back on red, matching them shot for shot, trying to get red back in. Looks like we have a slight blue lead with 45 seconds left. 14-48, Parsons Vikings out of Kansas, always dangerous with the climb for blue. We'll see what they do in this match. 24-15, back at it again. The Wired Cats scoring, scoring, scoring for blue. 29-59, taking that roll for red. One, two, three out of four up and in. Nine points quickly for the Red Alliance with 15 seconds left, match 87. 26-14 on the red side. Not to be outdone, Mars out of West Virginia, scoring for red. Five seconds to go, 24-15, putting in some last second discs for blue. Then they looks like they get a hang with one. That's the end of the match, 87. 115 to 97, the Blue Alliance comes out on top. Three, two, one, go! Match 88 underway in the Archimedes Field. 51, 846 on blue, moving quickly. All three Red Alliance robots shooting up and in. Blue not to be outdone, doing the same with their discs. We've got a virtual tie coming out of Autonomous. One last late shot from blue. Drivers step to the controls now immediately. Take their machines over to get reloaded with discs. 3467 on red, the Wyndham wind up out of New Hampshire, getting in position for some quick shooting. Able to put three of those four discs up and in for red. 3314 and 4450 on red. Lining up to do the same on blue, a rain of discs coming in from 4499, 51, and 846. The Funky Monkeys out of California. Matching red, shot for shot. 34-67 on red, reloaded, firing again, able to get two of those four to fall.
Just over a minute to go, it's anybody's match. 44-50, 34-67 in position to do some scoring for red, as is 51, Wings of Fire. The Delphi machine out of Michigan is doing for blue. Forty-five seconds now. Robots bobbing and weaving, darting all over the court. Eight forty-six, all over the field. Eight forty-six, able to score for blue. Thirty-four sixty-seven on the red side, keeping this close with thirty seconds. It could come down to who's hanging and where they're hanging. Human players in now to start throwing their colored discs to try and score. We've got one blue doesn't quite make it. One blue disc does make it into the pyramid goal. Blue robots hanging, 34-67 on the red side. The Wyndham windup, a 30-point hang. It looks like they're good there. Eight seconds to go. The hangs could mean everything in this match. Blue robots are up. Red robots are up with two, one. That's it for match 88. We've got machines hanging, very close scores on the discs. We'll sort it all out and bring you the final score shortly. 136 to 113. The climb points did make the difference. Red comes out on top of match 88. Three, two, one, go! All right, match 89 starts 15 seconds of autonomous. 42-65 and the entire Red Alliance moving quickly to score. We've got quick scoring from Blue as well. Team 801, 24-68, firing discs up and in. 16-60 adding its discs as well. We come out blue with a lead coming out of autonomous, it looks like. Driver step to the controls now. 120 seconds of driver controlled teleoperated period. Red Alliance machines on the far side. The red driver station's getting loaded. 801, 1660 for blue, doing some quick scoring, trying to maintain that lead. 801, horsepower out of Florida. 1660, the Harlem Knights, straight out of New York City. On the red side, 2709 looks like they're getting into the mix with 4265 on red, the Iron Wolves and Secret City Wild Bots. Team 801 horsepower doing more damage for the Blue Alliance. 2468 from 75% across the field, almost able to make those shots from the red pyramid shooting onto the blue side 1660 quick scoring for blue 4537 on the red side and 2709 doing quick scoring for red trying to catch up to that blue lead just over 45 seconds to go now blue still with a slight advantage 2468 4265 excuse me on the red side the secret city wild bots doing some quick scoring for red. But on the blue side, a barrage of discs from 1660 and 801 keeps blue in the lead. Less than 30 seconds to go now, match 89. Human players step up, begin throwing red and blue discs across the field trying to score. 2709 and 4265, some last second discs for red with 10 seconds to go. A lot of blue di discs flying into the blue score. Well, we have robots hanging. We've got a few up on red. Looks like all blue robots are trying to hang with two, one. Let's see in a match 89. We'll see how the scores shake out. Blue had a slight advantage coming into the hang period. Blue comes out 101 to 88. Blue out on top in match 89. Three, two, one, go. All right, match 90 underway. Blue Alliance with two rookies on the Alliance. Red going to work quickly. 379, we've seen them shoot, pick up, shoot, and score. Blue, though, doing some damage of its own. 44, 66, 45, 89, and 26, 04 on the blue side. Bring a slight lead out of Autonomous. Driver step to the controls now. Two minutes of teleoperated robot control. 44, 66 for blue. The Robo Hamsters out of Virginia scoring into the two-point goal, trying to extend blue's lead in this match. Thirty-two forty-five on the red side of the field. Trying to get something going. They are able to, to get moving. 379 getting some discs from the red load station. 
while 2604 on the blue side of the field trying to score for blue, not able to get any of those to fall. Minutes ago now in match 90, a lot of pushing and shoving right in front of the scorer's table as 379 on the red side. The RoboCats able to score, trying to pull red, able to pull even with blue in the match. A little more than 45 seconds to go. We're basically at a tie. Anybody's match is match 90. 379 back to the load station, able to pick up more discs and head back to the red side of the field. 379 with those discs able to put three out of four in, adding nine points for the red side. Less than 30 seconds to go now. Human players come in, could absolutely make a difference in this match. A long shot from red, able to score with a human player. 26-04 on the blue side, trying to give blue a little bit of a lead. 10 seconds to go, it's anybody's match. 379 on the red side, scoring discs for red. Blue machines are up, looks like red machines are up. We've got two, one. That's it for match 90. We'll sort out the scores, the discs, and the hangs, and we'll get you a score shortly. 63 to 42, red comes out on top of match 90. Three, two, one, go. Match 91, Archimedes Field, here we go. Blue starting quickly with quick shots from 254, up and in. Red on, on the red side. Flood of discs on the blue side, on the red side, 2016, 13, 34, and 46, 37, scoring as well. Very, very high scoring autonomous period. Blue and 254 had a flood of discs right at the end, and they looks like they came out on top at the end of autonomous. All right, 20, 2016 on the red side. Able to put this up and in, 254. Meanwhile, able to put six in and autonomous, get another four there for the Blue Alliance. 321 on the blue side is down, will be an obstacle that teams have to maneuver around. Meanwhile, 2705 on the blue side, able to score, trying to extend a slight lead. We Robot out of Minnesota, adding to Blue's total. 2016 on the red side, the mighty monkey rinses up and in. 1334 doing the same, scoring for red. Meanwhile, 254, the cheesy poofs on blue, able to score. With lead keeps going back and forth, and it's anybody's match with just over a minute to go. 2705 now for blue. We robot out of Eden Prairie, Minnesota. One, two, three. One falls out, able to score two. On the red side, 2016. 46, 37, and 13, 34. Raining discs on the red goals, trying to break out some kind of a lead. 40 seconds to go now. One, maybe two points separate the alliances. Match 91. 27, 05, 254 for blue, getting in position. Firing disc after disc after disc into the top goal. Meanwhile, on red, 2016, 46, 37, will not be outdone. Scoring as well on the red side. Less than 30 seconds, a long shot goes in for blue from the human side. Are they, can they make it two? They do make it two. 254, cheesy poofs have hung before. We've seen it. Less than 10 seconds. Who's going to hang where? 254 is up with a 30 point climb. 2705 on blue with two. One, we got red machines up as well. That's the end of match 91. A lot of robots hanging, a lot of discs scored. We'll see if there are penalties and get a final score out. 152 to 172. Blue comes out on top. 254's 30 point climb made the difference in match 91. Three, two, one, go. Match 92 underway. 15 seconds of autonomous. Blue starts quickly. 9, 10, 126, and 365 scoring quickly on the blue side. Meanwhile, 71 Team Hammond, 2704, and 3627. Able to match them basically disc for disc on the red side of the field. We come out of autonomous. Blue has a slight lead as drivers step to the controls. One twenty-six on the blue side, getting lined up. Gale Force out of Clinton, Massachusetts, able to put some points on the board for blue. 
365, adding to 126's total. The Miracle Workers scoring on the blue side. Meanwhile, Team 71, Team Hammond, able to put some points up for red. Blue extending their lead. 27-04, though, lined up. Order to chaos, lined up onto that two-point goal. Long shots all the way across the field, floating those in. 365 on blue, scoring one, two, three, up and in very, very quickly. We have dueling long shooters. 9-10, the Foley freeze for blue, launching into the high goal. 27-04 for red into the two-point goal. Both of them load and fire, load and fire. 71 for Hammond on the red side, able to add two reds total. Blue still carrying a slight lead, just under a minute now in match 92. 36-27 for red doing some damage. Jungle Robotics out of Florida, adding to red's total. 2704 keeps pumping this. 910 has abandoned its long shot and is over now to block the red discs. 71, Team Hammond, we've seen him score 30 before, have already started their climb. As 126 on the blue side keeps firing discs into the three point goal. Less than 2.2, excuse me, less than 30 seconds to go. Hammond is above the 20 point hang limit. They are in the 30 point limit now. 2704 continuing the long shots for red. Just over 10 seconds to go. Will we see any blue robots hanging? 126, 365, adding some last second discs before all the blue robots attempt to hang with three, two, one. That's it, we've got machines up. 71, Team Hammond is up on the red side. We'll see who comes out on top. 161 to 115, blue pulls out a win in match 92. Three, two, one, go. All right, match 93 underway. 15 seconds of autonomous. Blue striking quickly on the red side. 44-71 and 11,000. Scoring disc after disc for red. 525 and 4470. Able to put points on the board for blue. Blue carries a slight lead out of autonomous. Drivers at the controls now take their machines to the load zones to gather discs. You can carry four at any one time. 11,000 just loaded up at the human player station, able to get four discs into its pocket underneath the red pyramid now. Able to put three of four up and in. 973 for blue, able to get one of their four discs to fall as well. Blue still a slight lead in match 93. Team 525 looking to score for blue. The Swart Dogs out of Iowa able to get one of those three discs to fall. Team 11,000 has to deal with a bit of defense from 4470. The Tiger Robot on the blue side. 11,000 not able to get those discs to fall. 525 scoring for blue, dealing with some defense from Team 11 on the red side of the field. Less than a minute now, match 93. 525 back at it with this. Able to put one, two, three. Can they make it four? They can as 973 right over the top of them. The gray bots out of California able to add to blue's total. Team 11,000 back underneath the pyramid still dealing with 4470 playing some serious defense on their shots. Less than 30 seconds to go. 11,000 able to deal with it, put two up and in for red. 973 though counters with four shots up and in on the blue side. 15 seconds now, match 93. Human players are throwing red and blue discs into the field, trying to add to scores. We've got one human player score on the blue side. 973 and 525 adding to blue's lead. Three seconds, will we have any hangers? Two, one, blue's got some machines up, as does red. We'll sort out the scores and bring that back shortly. 113 to 56, blue comes out on top. Three, two, one, go! Match 94 underway. 955 striking quickly on the blue side of the field. 1756, Argos 2165 and 2081 on red. Striking quickly, two machines out of Peoria, Illinois on that red alliance. On the blue side, team 987 able to put Discs up and in the high rollers out of Las Vegas as well. We come out blue with a lead out of Autonomous. Red Robots immediately to the low stations. 987 and 955 on the blue side do the same. 
Long shots now from 987. Able to put one, two, three, four, five. They keep going up into that two point goal. Two points for blue for every one they hit. Meanwhile, in red, 2081, Icarus able to add to red's total with a couple of three point shots. 955 for blue, CV Robotics all the way from Oregon, able to add to blue's total, trying to maintain a lead in match 94. 987, the high rollers keep doing what they do, over and over, one, two, three, up and into the two point goal. 694 now on blue, Stipulse out of New York City, able to add to blue's total as well. 2081 and 1756, the two Peoria machines on the Red Alliance, able to put a number of discs into the three-point goal on red. Less than a minute to go. Blue still with the lead in match 94. 987 on blue, trying to add to it. High rollers, meanwhile, 2165, the Trailblazers, and 2081 on the red side, trying to do something about that lead. Shot after shot into the top goal. 955 though, 987 on blue won't be outdone, trying to take this match home for the Blue Alliance. 30 seconds now, human players step up with their discs, can launch those into the field if they choose to. 2081 Icarus getting one last load of discs. See if he can get some last second points on the red side. 2165 already up and hanging. 987, some last second dish, disc shots on the Blue Alliance. Five seconds now, Blue still with the lead, 955, adding to it with Blue Disc. Meanwhile, with two, one, we got robots all over the field. That's the end of match 94. Robots hanging all over the field, I should say. 196 to 127. Blue Alliance comes out on top with 196 points. Three, two, one, go. Here we go with match 95. The Archimedes Field, 2486, starting off with a couple of shots on the blue side. 2457 for red and 30,003 able to score on the red side of the field. Blue taking a lead out of the autonomous period, 236 and 1902 adding to that blue lead. Drivers step to the controls, take their machines to get this, pick them up off the floor or get them loaded from their human players. 291 immediately playing defense on 236 on the far side of the field. 231 CIA out of Erie, Pennsylvania. 1902 back to the blue side, quickly loaded. 1902 exploding bacon, able to add to blue's lead. 30,003 on the red side, looks like they're in position to block 2486 from long shots across the field. Twenty-four fifty-seven and two thirty-six, mixing it up at midfield. Twenty-four eighty-six and nineteen oh two, trying to get in position to score for blue. Two ninety-one, able to play some defense, deflect a lot of blue shots. A couple do fall, adding to the blue lead. Thirty thousand and three, all by themselves on the red side of the field, able to put three of four up and in for nine points for the Red Alliance. Less than a minute now, blue still carrying a slight lead in match ninety-five. 236 on the blue side. Looks like they're starting one of their big, big climbs. We've seen them do it before. Could be a game changer in this match. A lot of defense being played as 291, 30,003, and 2457 all trying to block blue shots in different ways. 2486 though, Coconuts out of Arizona able to get a couple of discs up and in for blue. With 15 seconds to go, 236 looks like they're winching that last piece up to get a 30 point climb will we see other robots hanging on the pyramids. Four seconds to go now, robots trying on both sides. We could have all six up with one. That's the end of match 95. We do have machines up. We'll see if we had all six hanging. 94 to 65, the Blue Alliance comes out ahead. Match 95. Three, two, one, go. Match 96 underway. Starting quickly on the red side. 10, 71, 32, 42, and 31, 45. Meanwhile, 36, 12, and 172 on blue with 639 doing some scoring as well. As close as we can get to tide coming out of the autonomous period. 
Remember the live scoring, not 100% accurate, but we trust it enough to know that we came out neck and neck. Machines now head to the load stations, get four discs if they want, three discs if they want, head back and attempt to score. Thirty-two forty-two for red, able to put one, two, three, four, up and in. Thirty-one forty-five for red, able to score the red disc into the pyramid goal. Those are five points apiece, able to get two to go. Team 172 now for blue. Trying to get blue back up to a tie with red, able to get one of those discs to fall in. 172 adds another for blue. Northern Force out of Maine. Meanwhile, 32-42 on red, the Illumicats putting one, two, three up and in, trying to extend Red's lead. Thirty-one forty-five. look like they're getting in position for a big hang. Starting this early in the match usually means something big is coming. We will watch them on the red side of the field. 45 seconds to go now, pushing and shoving on the red side of the field as 32-42 trying to extend Red's lead with some more three-point shots. One, two, three, up and in. 31-45 for red, starts its winch up towards the top of the pyramid. Less than 30 seconds now, team 172 out of Maine. Once again, trying to bring blue back into alignment with red here, up into a tie. Discs flying all over the field as human players are able to start throwing their red and blue discs for score as well. 32-42, some late shots for red, trying to add to the point total. 31-45, winching itself up. Looks like they're into the second zone with two, one. That's it, we've got some machines hanging on blue, maybe some machines hanging on red, and defi definitely a 20 point climb on the red side. 106 to 72, red pulls out the win. Match 96 on the Archimedes field. Three, two, one, go! All right, match 97, 15 seconds of autonomous, 868. Techown machine, the Rolls-Royce machine out of Carmel, Indiana, has a couple of regional wins under its belt. This year, Team 78 on the blue side, doing some scoring for blue, paired with 930 out of McQuanago, Wisconsin, and Team 2408. Meanwhile, 33, the Killer Bees, we've seen them do damage, adding to the Reds total. Red bring, brings a lead out of Autonomous. 868, the Techowns, with if, as efficient as they have ever been, able to put more points up on the board for Red. Team 78 on the blue side of the field, trying to add to Blue's total as well. One, two, three, able to get those to score in the top goal for Blue, three points apiece. 868 getting a little bit of defense from 2408 on the blue side, able to deflect those, but 33, the Killer Bees, says don't worry, I'll step in, able to score still for the Red Alliance. 78. Team 78 now for Blue. One, two, can they make it three, up and in. 868, the Tech Hounds out of Carmel, Indiana, doing more scoring for red, extending that red lead. One minute to go, match 97. 98. Team 2408 on the blue side of the field, out of Hazelwood, Missouri, the Sergeants doing some scoring into the two point goal, two points for every disc they put in. 78 back in the game for blue. Able to put one, two, three, and maybe four up and in on the blue side. Meanwhile, 868, 33, the Killer Bees, awfully good pair together. Able to score more points for Red, extend Red's lead. 25 seconds to go now. 868 getting loaded, getting a little bit of defense from 930, the Bears getting loaded for one more run. 15 seconds to go now. Team 33, the Killer Bees for Red. Look like they're getting ready to hang. 938, getting ready to hang for blue. 78 on the blue side, adding some last second points with the disc with two, one. That's it, we've got red robots up. We've got at least one blue robot up. 191 to 74, red comes out on top. Three, two, one, go! Here we go, folks, getting started with qualification match number 98. The red alliance comes out shooting, as does the blue alliance. 80-40 for the Blue Alliance, responsible for the last two scores. 
for the Red Alliance. It's a combination of 25, 90, 17, 47, and 45, 85, all part of the scoring drive. At the end of our opening period, we have the Blue Alliance ahead by four, 54 to 50. Teleoperated period now underway. Flag now being tossed by the head referee on the far side of the field against the Red Alliance, it appears. Foul could have been charged to 45-85. Uh, That's the Husky Robotics team. Action now shifts over to the Blue Alliance side of the field. Coming around the front of the field, it's 1967, taking up station keeping duties. A zipping past them, moving from right to left is 1747. That's the Harrison Boiler Robotics team. They're on the move. They've got a very quick, agile robot. Now maneuvering into position on the red side of the field. It shoots. Check that. It's Alliance Partner shoots. 25-90 collecting up high for nine points to add to the Red Alliance. Still a close one. Blue Alliance still out in front. 76 to 75. This is anybody's match. It's going to come right down to the wire. 46 seconds remaining in the match. A lot of activity on the far side of the field now. Far side of the field, that'll be the far side of Blue Alliance Feeder Station. 15-19 was there, now they move forward, they shoot, and they connect on one of the three shots. 30 seconds remaining in the match. Here comes 80-40 for the Blue Alliance. Red Alliance has taken the lead now. Blue Alliance looking to keep it close, trying to narrow the gap. 80-40 shoots. From the base of the Blue Alliance Pyramid, they connect 15-19, far side of the field. Also at the Blue Alliance Pyramid, climbs on and hangs for 10. Closing seconds now, three seconds remaining. It appears that at least one Red Alliance robot is fully supported. It'll be up to the head referee if 25-90 was able to get there in time. 126 to 116, it's the Red Alliance. 3, 2, 1, go, go, go! Here we go, folks. The autonomous period has begun. 15 seconds in which the robots are operating without human intervention. Both alliances able to get their shots off. Blue Alliance able to capitalize early. Period will come to a close. Unofficially at the end of our opening period, 36 to 18, Blue Alliance out in front. Red Alliance knows what they need to do, and if there's anybody that can do it, these three teams working together can do so. Red Alliance will be looking to narrow the gap. First in position is 316 for the Blue Alliance. They shoot and they score up high. Each disc hoard inside the center goal is worth three points. Moving into shooting range now, far side of the field, 701. That's the Robo Vikes. And they begin shooting. They've got a rapid fire mechanism that allows them to connect, picking up 12 points for their alliance. During that last exchange, there was a foul called on the Red Alliance. Contact in a protected zone. Blue Alliance is out in front at the one minute mark, 71 to 18. Red Alliance looking to try to narrow the gap. Action now at the base of the Blue Alliance Pyramid. That's 316 that's in shooting position. Here comes 701. Of the far side, now all three Blue Alliance robots are there and preparing to shoot. 701, locked and loaded. And disc away. First one is just a little bit high. Second one goes in, as does the third. 30 seconds remaining in the match now. Blue Alliance looking to extend their lead. Red Alliance just trying to narrow the gap now. The Rolls-Royce machine being operated by the rookie team, trying to take on 316, keep it out of firing range. 701 slips past them. Shooting mechanism is uh, maneuvered into position. Now they shoot. Three shots, none of them hit home. Period comes to a close. Well, folks, here we go. Your scores are in for match number 99, 96 to 40. It is the Blue Alliance. E, two, one, go. 
And here we go, folks. Qualification match number 100, 3310 and company leading the charge for the Red Alliance. Blue Alliance aren't slouching either. 4810 and team number 20 connecting in the center high and the medium height goals. It's a close one at the end of our opening period, 32 to 30. Blue Alliance out in front by two. Teleoperated period now underway. Drivers are in full control. Robots are positioned properly and they begin shooting. 326 is a long distance shooter. The Uni Eagles connecting in the two point goal. Their alliance partner is 3310. That's the Blackhawk Robotics team. They're from Rockwall Heath High School, certainly making a name for themselves this year here at the championships. 80 seconds remaining in the match. Blue Alliance is out in front, 56 to 50. Red Alliance trying to find a way to close the gap. Another two point score by 326. 326 is a little robot there on the near side Red Alliance feeder station shooting all the way across the court and connecting with the two-point goal. Now the action shifts to the Blue Alliance. Team 20 and Team 48-10 combining to tie the score now and then to take the lead. 81-77, Red Alliance in the lead for the first time in the match. Thirty-five, 35 seconds remaining in the match now. It's a close one, folks. There's still time for anyone to take it all the way. 33-10 now for the Red Alliance at the base of the Red Pyramid. They shoot and score up high, picking up nine additional points. Red Alliance now with 116 points. Now there's a penalty flag. This foul being thrown against the Blue Alliance. Foul points will automatically be awarded to the Red Alliance. Two Red Alliance robots now hanging in the 10-point area on the pyramid, Blue Alliance continues to shoot and score. That's it, this one is over. Back in a moment with your official results. Qualification match number 100, it's 145 to 121 in favor of the Red Alliance. Three, two, one, go! And here we go, folks. Quick movement from the far side of the field. That's 44-66. Both alliances got their shots off at the same time, but the Red Alliance has come on strong. Blue Alliance trying to make up the difference now in the closing seconds, and they keep it close. 34-30, Red Alliance is out in front with a four-point advantage. Teams now make their way over to the nearest feeder station. The human players, known as feeders, quickly reload these robots and then send them on their way. Getting into position first for the Red Alliance will be first team 3467. Disc away and they connect one, two, three, four times. Their alliance partner is 1100. They come in and they connect as well. 1100, of course, the T-Hawks representing Algonquin Regional High School. Plenty of action, all of it on the red side of the field. Blue Alliance defenders trying to keep 1,100 from the feeding stations there. Now shots fired, 27.09 for the Blue Alliance, the Iron Wolves. Iron Wolves is a great team out of Chicago, Illinois. They represent Perspectives IT Math and Science Academy. So a real defensive battle now between 4466 for the Blue Alliance and 1100. 4466, a very tough robot, Robo Hamsters, that put together a very strong defensive machine. 3467 for the Red Alliance, continues to shoot and score. Red Alliance now extending their lead, 79 to 60. Less than 30 seconds remaining. Blue Alliance has been trying to regroup and figure out how they can put some points on the board. Now they're in position. Two robots shooting, 27.09 and 21.37. 21.37, of course, Team Tort. Now teams beginning their assault on the pyramid. 34.67, clearly in 20-point range and reaching for higher. That's it, period comes to a close. This one is all over.
101-84. It is the Red Alliance on top. E, two, one, go, go, go! And we're underway with qualification match number 102. 440, 44-71, and for the Blue Alliance, teaming up with 44-50 and 45-01, the All-Rookie Alliance put points on the board. Red Alliance will finish the opening period with 36. Blue Alliance has 18. Teleoperated period now underway. Drivers in full control. Now fouls being thrown on one of the Blue Alliance teams. Looks like it was on 4501. Could have been 4471. Contact in a protected zone. 4450, far side of the field for the Blue Alliance. Shoots and connects. Giving the Blue Alliance 24 points. Red Alliance extending their lead now. 46-73 is the rookie team there at the base of the Red Alliance Pyramid. Boys then waiting now. Not sure if it's gonna be an offensive player or if it's there for a defensive battle. Doesn't appear to be moving. Team members there at the driver station working hard to try to straighten it out. Now 44-71 picks up another foul flag. Again, contact in a protected zone there at the base of the pyramid. 4450 comes screaming down from right to left. Pauses, then shoots a little bit short. Recalibrate, shoots again, this time just a bit too high. Now they move in closer, and that one was just right. For the Red Alliance, it's 254. That'll be the cheesy poos. They're now underneath the Red Alliance pyramid. They shoot one, two, three, four, go in for 12 points through the high center three-point goal. Watching now as the Cheesy Puffs pull themselves up, well within 20-point range. They reach up even higher now, pulling themselves well up into 30-point range. Red Alliance with 146 points. Nearly a 100-point advantage as this period comes to a close. 179 to 69 in favor of the Red Alliance. Three, two, one, go, go, go. Here we go, folks. Qualification match number 103 underway. This firing for both alliances now. NRG for the Blue Alliance operating during the autonomous period. Onboard targeting system acquired the target. They were able to add to the overall score for the Blue Alliance. 64-36 at the end of our opening period. Period two now underway. That's a tele-operated period. Drivers have stepped forward, taken the controls, and now begin guiding their robots out and about the field. First order of business was to reload, and now that the robots are fully reloaded, shooting begins. 17-56 for the Red Alliance, able to connect up high. Then the action shifts down to the Blue Alliance side of the field. That's 836, base of the Blue Pyramid, shooting and scoring up high in the center for three points. Breaking the action now, then 24-15 for the Blue Alliance, begins shooting three of their four shots connect to add an additional nine points to the overall score. NRG from midcourt, Able to connect on some of their shots. Now a foul flag thrown on team at 321. That's the Robo Lancers. Those foul points will be awarded then to the Blue Alliance. Back to the action. All of it now inside the Blue Alliance zone. 24-15 shoots and scores for the Blue Alliance. That's the Wiredcats out of Atlanta, Georgia. 132.75, still more than half a minute remaining in the match. Now foul flag thrown against on 32, check that, 321. Coming up on the 15 second mark, 140 to 86. Blue Alliance trying to put a little icing on the cake. One of their robots beginning to climb up 
onto the pyramid. NRG trying to get there, but it's gonna be 321 that held him off. Not sure, head referee was looking at 321. 178 to 119, it is the Blue Alliance. Three, two, one, go! And we're ready to get started now. Blue Alliance strikes first, connecting up high. Each one of the Discord and the high goal is worth six points. But out comes the Red Alliance, and they're storming all three robots connecting up high. Period comes to a close. Blue Alliance out in front, 57 to 35. Teleoperated period now underway. Drivers begin guiding their machines around the field. And it's 987 for the Blue Alliance. That's the high rollers. They're connecting for the big score. 69 to 33 thus far. 71 slides in. That's Team Hammond. They're underneath the Blue Alliance pyramid. Shots coming up just a little bit short. Now the action shifts to the red side of the field. 27-05. Scoring on their last two attempts. Shooting long range now is 4470, but right there in its face is the Blue Alliance robot 3003. 3003, of course, the tanks, a great defensive machine. That long shooting mechanism, that robotic arm, allows them to block the shots that are coming from 4407. The tie gears trying to figure out a way to get around them. Less than a minute remaining in the match. 96 to 48 is our score. Blue Alliance is out in front. Teams Tamman now trying to climb up the inside of the Blue Alliance pyramid. They're using their patented hook and ladder system to get them in the 20 point range. And they look like they aren't done yet. They're gonna try to climb even higher. In the meantime, it's 2705 and 30 point range. If they can stay there, that'll be 30 additional points for the Red Alliance, and they sure need it. 16 seconds, 123 to 47. Blue Alliance is out in front. Now Team 71 in 30-point range, and 987 down below, underneath the Blue Alliance pyramid, shooting and scoring. Final seconds now. That's it. This one is over. Outstanding match play. 188 to 89, it is the Blue Alliance. Three, two, one, go! 639 drives the lane while 1075 dropping in those six point goals. 365 to Miracle Workers shoot and score another 12, 18 extra points. All right, let's step up and drive. It's the ultimate ascent. 33-14 takes their shot from the blue line and scores another three points for the Blue Alliance. 16-60 and 10-75 over in the feeder zone for the Red Alliance. Meanwhile, 868 and 639 doing a little battle and 868 breaks away, comes all the way over to the blue line, takes over position and shoots. And scores another three, six, nine, 12 points for the Blue Alliance. 33-14, the mechanical Mustang scoring well. Oh, a little bit high on that last shot. Miracle Workers are at the crossbar. They take a shot, they shoot, they score. And an all-out assault on a three-point goal by the Blue Alliance. Well, only 75 seconds to go in the match. Blue Alliance is back down, getting a fresh cache of disc in their machine. Miracle Workers over in the far side on the protected zone. 33-14 takes up a position. 868 is going to join them. Last minute of play. Last minute of play. Miracle workers drain in another six, nine points. They sprint back down to the safety of the protected loading zone. 639 in the middle of the field. Tried to put on a little defense, but 868 split the defense and made it in under the pyramid. 34 seconds left. 639's making their way over to the pyramid. They got one of the red deaths to stay up there with that elevated shooter. Got 22 seconds left.
33-14, still scoring away for the Blue Alliance. Miracle Workers trying to get past the defense at 639. Got eight seconds left. Miracle Workers are in position. They're at the bar. They turn with three, two, one, and they start shooting away. Winning by a score of 141 to 66, the Blue Alliance. Three, two, one, go. 973 drops three quick ones, go down the middle of the field. They're going for a multiple disc autonomous. Now they pick up some more and they come back. So the Las Gorillas are going for a seven shot also. Got a six on the one side. Can the Las Gorillas pull it off? Oh, time expires here in the autonomous portion of match 106. 973 picking up all that low hanging fruit down in front of the blue goals. Having a trouble with their feeder. Meanwhile, the Las Gorillas are over in the feeder station. They take the long shot, they shoot it, score! From 51 feet, three inches away. Now 973 stops scoring, goes into a defensive mode. Las Gorillas break off their attack and move around to the far side of the field. They're scooting down the far side. Take up a position on the left side of the pyramid while 973 Takes up a position on their side of the pyramid. Las Gorillas are picking up more of that low-hanging fruit on the ground. They take another long shot. They shoot that score again from 50 feet away. 32-42 drops in a couple more for the Blue Alliance. Meanwhile, the Gorillas are picking up more of that loose fruit there. And their partner, 1448, has a full complimented red disc in their machine. They're going up over the second level. They're in for 20 points now. Gorillas are back down in the feeder station. Got 41 seconds. Lots of gorillas start taking those long shots again, and they're good. They break away, go underneath the other pyramid. And they got the disc up on top. 14.48. I can't tell it's three or four from this distance, but there's 23 seconds left. Las Gorillas are back in. Picking up four more discs. They take off and start running down the middle of the field. They split the defense. 9.30's up for 10. They're trying to get there for 10. Las Gorillas got 10 seconds left. They drop in a few more machines. Got two seconds left. Grassfields with two seconds left. Score another 10 points for the Red Alliance. Winning by a score of 204 to 148, the Red Alliance. Yay, Red Alliance, yay. Three, two, one, go. Blue Alliance gets the first four shots off and they're good. Red Alliance is starting the answer. 172 puts the one in. 24-57, K-Pac machines. Kind of jammed up there. Now step up and drive, it's the ultimate ascent. Northern Force makes their way down to the feeder station. K-Pac goes around the far side of the field. 24-57 is trying to play a little defense on the Blue Alliance. Now they're making their way back. There's a long shot, and they shoot and score the 24 68 team. Uh, appreciate. They're scoring from all over the field. Meanwhile, 316 and 864 are doing a good job underneath the Blue Pyramid. At 316 team, the Lunatics out of Carney's Point, New Jersey's. Picking up all that low hanging fruit, leaving up a little bit for 486. The Funky Monkey out of San Jose. 316 shoots the one, two, three. There's another 12 points to the Blue Alliance. Funky Monkey's getting into position underneath the pyramid. Lunatics go back out to the far side. There's a long shot by the team appreciate. Just a little bit off the mark. But that one's good. They got two quick ones from that long distance, about 52 feet, three and a quarter inches away. And 172, the Northern Force drains a couple more good points for the Blue Alliance. Or... K-Pack team seems to be hung up on a disc on the far side of the field. 24-57 is taking some long shots, but they're going over the top of the backboard. 
Got 20 seconds left. Funky Monkeys making their climb. Looks like they're gonna go for the second level. That's a swing and a miss so far. Got 10 seconds left. Funky Monkey trying to adjust. Five seconds. 2457. Two of the red robots got hung up on their uh, bumpers. Winning by a score of 163 to 45, the Blue Alliance. Three, two, one, go. I am robot drives up, gets a little closer look at that target. Meanwhile, 1071, just Team Max making all those six point shots. Remember, all point values are doubled during the autonomous portion of each and every match. Airstrike trying to make their way back down. The 4810 machine, the rookie out of Michigan, trying to play a little defense. Now they make their way back down and load up on the feeder station. Ten seventy one in midfield. The fifteen nineteen machine is trying to loft them in there. There they go. They found the range on the two point goal. Just floating them in there nice and gently. They're making that shot from about 52 feet, eight and a quarter inches away. 78 airstrike makes another three point score for the Blue Alliance. Meanwhile, I am robot makes their way back down to the far side of the field. Takes up a position on the left side of the pyramid. 24 or 2704 is making those long shots into the three point goal. They're being very successful. Now the airstrike gets in there and starts slowing them down. That's order to case chaos out of Illinois. I am robots playing the defense and helping their partner out that long distance shooter. Down to the last 35 seconds. 15 19 breaks off in their long shots. I am robot picks up a couple more frisbees from their human player. Airstrike's got some disc in their machine. They're coming back down to the far side of the field. They take up a position over by the pyramid. They're taking aim, they shoot. Oh, a little bit low on that shot. Got 12 seconds left. Airstrike misses their first two shots. Human players are now introducing the red and blue discs. 17, 10, or 10, 71's up for 10. And time expires and we might have a few robots hanging in the breeze. Winning by two points, the Red Alliance, 92 to 90. Wow, that's close. Three, two, one, go. 1334 drops in there. Three killer bees are putting in theirs. Now the killer bees are going for the seven disc autonomous. 1334 crossed over, but the seven. Uh, Disc autonomous was successful. We got a 54-27 lead for the Blue Alliance. Meanwhile, the killer bees are at midfield, fucking up all that low-hanging fruit. They come back down to the red side. Dragons are in the middle. Bees in the middle. 1334 makes their way over to the corner. They shoot, oh, off the side of the bay. Killer bees back into the feeder station. Meanwhile, the Red Alliance is drilling those dragons. Make, oh, off both sides of the goal. Killer bees are back underneath the middle. Trying to cut down on the Howling Ewan Eagles. Their partner, 694, is laying down some defense. There's an open shot. They shoot and score from 50 feet and one and a quarter inches away. Killer Bees still picking up that low hanging fruit. 1595, the Dragons out of Spokane, Washington, doing a great job trying to keep this a close game, but it's about a 30 point spread. 89 54 with 45 seconds to go in the match. Killer Bees back down to the red zone all by themselves. They're picking up those discs. There's a long shot by the Dragons, a little bit short. 
Nice shot. They got the blue disc in there before the time expired. 30 seconds left. They're starting to back drive. Can they stay? Well, there's, looks like they're staying above it. Meanwhile, the killer bees are over in the bottom of the... Got 15 seconds left. Oh, there's a smoke party going on over in the corner. Little white smoke coming off of the Romulus team. 694 tries to climb up and they got it. It looks like, let's hope they stay. And so is the Killer Bees. Winning by a score of 186 to 60, the Blue Alliance. Three, two, one, go! Morton, 25-90. Picking all up that loose one's going for a multiple disc autonomous. All right, let's step up and drive. It's the ultimate ascent. 25-90 gets off their four shots. They pick up some more of that low hanging fruit in the midfield. Forty-two sixty-five drops in another 12 points for the Blue Alliance. Runs back down to the safety of the feeder station. That's a secret city wild bots out of Oak Ridge, Tennessee. 3145 is making their climb early. That's the Terravikes. Cycling through their mechanism. 4265 is back up for another volley of four, and they're successful again. 2590 is picking up all that loose hanging fruit down on the floor, down by the red feeder station. Meanwhile, 2081 for the Blue Alliance, uh, the Peoria, Illinois team. Pick up another cache of four. They take aim at a three point goal. They shoot, oh, one that's a little bit low, but the rest of them were good. 3145 still cycling through their mechanism. They're up to the 20 point level for the Blue Alliance. Got 45 seconds to go in the match. They're attached up at the top for the three, 30 points. They're balling themselves up. Mort still down there draining away those points. It's still a tight game. It's a two point game with 22 seconds to go in the match. 2081 trying to get into position. They pick it up and they swing in. They're good for 10. 2590 is already there. Mort's going in for it. Can they pull it off with seven seconds left? They shoot and they got it. 4265 with no time remaining. I don't know if they were able to pull the trigger. Winning by a score of 150 to 137, the Blue Alliance. Three, two, one, go! 291 drives a lane down to the far end for the one point goal, and they scored. Two points scored over on the far side, but it's really four points because all point values are double during the autonomous portion. Red Alliance makes their way down real quick, picking up the 291 machine, being joined by their partner in the 1967 machine. Uh, good year, the Janksters. 291 back in that low goal, and they score four quick ones. Forty-seven thirty-one. that takes a shot and then falls back in the, to the friendly confines of their loading zone. Meanwhile, 34-78 lining up outside the red line. 16-10, the bot. Making their way back down to the feeder station. 1967's coming back down for another cache of disc into their machine. They pull up in front of the protected feeder station, so it's 291, their partner. Meanwhile, 34-78. Seems to be in a defensive battle with a robot that's not moving. 47-31 uh -huh. trying to get a shot off, but 16-10 is draining those three-pointers from right in front of it, and almost a slam dunk shot. 
291 is making another run down to the far end of the field. It's only a 10 point game at this point with 34 seconds to go in the match. Still close for anybody to go. 291 trying to get past the defense. They squirt through and go down to the low goal. 1967 makes their way back. Having a little control issue. Now they're speeding around the far side of the field. Cutting down the far side of the field, come up, they line up on the tower. 291's already there for 10 points. There's 12 seconds left in the match. 1967's already there. 3478's trying to make their way. They drive toward it. Close their robot. Can they get the drive train off? Oh, and time expires on our heroes here at match 111. Uh, winning by a score of 65 to 49, Red Alliance. Three, two, one, go! 525 drives over to the far side of the field. Takes their first shot. Clinton uh, making their shots. We got about a 10 point game. 54-44, advantage blue. Seventeen forty-seven just stopped working. Now the one twenty-six, like Kale Force, scoring at will with ninety-seven seconds to go in the match. Two thirty-six making their way. That techno takes out of Lime, Ohio or Connecticut. They have a cache of red disc in their machine. They're going up. Seventeen forty-seven made their way over to the far side of the field. Flight still flashing, but here comes twenty-five forty-three and the Gale Force making their way down here to the blue of pyramid. Meanwhile, two thirty-six is up to the top. The Techno Ticks from Old Lime, Connecticut. They're almost in position to lock in. They have those red discs. Let's see how many they got. Got 42 seconds to go. I saw one go in, two. Oh, one fell down. Uh oh, three fell down. We're into the last 30 seconds. Four thirty-three makes their way over to the pyramid. They're taking a look at it. Still a tight game, 132 to 47, advantage blue. Gale Force is in position to hang. 525's right there, but they missed on the far right side. And as time expires, Gale Force pops up for a quick 10. Winning by a score of 147 to 87, not blue alliance. Three, two, one, go! Blue Alliance misses on their first two shots, but they score on the next one. Wings of Fire scoring from the right side. 1902 takes a couple of shots over on the left. Got one second left. Step up and drive is the ultimate ascent. Wings of fire fill up with a compliment of four. Meanwhile, 701 has met them at right head on. Wings of fire oh, taking it for a tour of the field, taking back to midfield. Wings of fire breaks off and goes down and makes for a scoring position. 1902 is over on the far side, picking up discs for the Red Alliance. Meanwhile, 701, the Robo Vikes out of California take a shot. Oh, it's a little bit high. Now they found the mark, the Robo Vikes. Their partner, the 2160, the Trailblazers, making their mark. 1714 has a complement of four red or blue discs in their machine as they're making their way up with one minute to play. One minute to play. 
Wings of Fire going down the far side. Get around their own partner, 812. They take up position. They dropped one disc. A little shake, little shimmy for the Wings of Fire out of Pontiac. They shoot and scored. Meanwhile, that Blue Alliance robot, 17-14. The more robotics out of Milwaukee. Looks like they're getting a little bit of a scissors lift with delivering mechanism. They shoot, get it even, and they got them. Four discs. Wings of Fire are up for 10. 1902 is up for 10. 2165 0701's coming in with one second left. Can they pull it up? And it looks like they got it with no time remaining. Kermito, Mr. Gravity, took over and helped them out. Winning by a score of 129 to 95, the Blue Alliance. Three, two, one, go! Blue Alliance gets that first shot off. The first three are good. Four, but one makes a miss. And then 379 is going for a seven disc Auton. Can they pull it off with four seconds left? Oh, they couldn't cycle through in time. So step up and drive. It's the ultimate ascent. 4499 making their way down. The Highlanders out of Fort Collins, Colorado. Going over to the safety of the protected feeder station. Meanwhile, their partner 379 is already there. The Robocats out of Girard, Ohio. 2486 picking up a cache in their machine. Meanwhile, the other rookie 47, 53s. Got a load going down to the far side of the field. But the 379 machine, the Robocats out of Ohio scoring Will willfully at that three point goal. 81 seconds to go in the match. RoboCats getting another catch, hey, but Team 20, the Rocketeers out of Clifton Park, New York. Trying to keep it a close match. It's 96-33, advantage to the Red Alliance. Blue Alliance has got a lot of discs on the floor down there. 24-86 was starting to turn on the machine for the long shots, but 35-04 shut it down quick. The Ohio team scores a quick six points more for the Blue Lions. 44-99s cycling their mechanism, trying to get up. There they go. Now they're climbing up with 17 seconds to go in the match. They're clipped on and they're going up for it. They're good for 20. 379's over in the corner trying to get on. Looks like we might have three for the red. Oh, and time expires. Winning by a score of 165 to 75, the Red Alliance. Three, two, one, go! Blue Alliance gets the first shot for another six points. And the 26-14 machine is adding to the Red Alliance score. Looks like a 32-30 game. Step up and drive for the ultimate ascent. 26-14 on the Red Alliance at the Mars out of Morgantown, West Virginia. Big Moe's getting fed over there. Now 36-27 comes in, trying to play a little. Defense trying to clear a path for Big Mo. Big Mo breaks off and goes down the far side of the field. There we go. The Blue Alliance is starting to find the range, getting those six or three pointers in there. It's a one point game at this end, but Big Mo drops in another nine points for the Blue Alliance. Eight forty, trying to keep Big Mo out. Eight forty is in there. Oh, they drew a penalty on that one. 
Big Moe's in the protection of the loading zone. Eight forty still trying to shut down the long shot of the Megatron Oracle. Meanwhile, the seventeen ninety six machines over there filling up with another cache of four discs. They got a full load now. They're coming down the field, crossing over the red line in center field. Take a position underneath the pyramid. Big Moe's got the machine turned on. Here comes the onslaught. Oh, they're shooting a little low. They got to readjust for that. Thirty one seconds to go in the match. 36-27 is still playing that defense on 8:40. Big Mo's got 20 seconds left. 36-27 is trying to get up and add a little 10 points for the Red Alliance. It's still a close game, about 20 points. 17-96 already positioned for 10 points for the Blue. 32.45 is there as time expires. They jump on and add another 10 points. It's a tight one, 111 to 90, the Red Alliance. Three, two, one, go! Team 20 picking up those loose ones in front of it. They spin. Mort takes his shot and runs over to the midfield. Team 20 drags him in. And Got a 58-28 game, Vantage uh, Blue. Mort's mixing it up with 291, uh, creativity in action, not a eerie PA. 987 drops in another 12 points for the Red Alliance. Trying to close that gap, it's only a 15 point game at this point. Few misses by the Blue Alliance on that one. Red Alliance got two robots down here at this end. 987 back under the safety of the pyramid, drops in another 12 points, runs back down to the far end of the field. That's the high rollers out of Las Vegas. High rollers are back in there, 17. Um, 14, the more robotics has a full complement of red disc in their machine. One minute to play, one minute to play. Mort's first two shots are low, next two are good. Oh, the Rocketeers get blocked by the 291 machine, the creativity in action. 17, 14 still making their way up. Got 38 seconds, should be plenty of time for them. Meanwhile, the high rollers, the 987 machines making multiple trips. There's the last 30 seconds. They got a full complement. They're running down the far side of the field. They pull up in between, just inside the red line. Meanwhile, their partners, the more robotics is right there. Got that scissors lift going. Can they pull the trigger on it with those four decisions? They score! The Red Alliance! 291's in position. High rollers are right there with them. They got their hooks up with four seconds left. High rollers are shoot, they good. And the Rocketeers, as time expires, climb up and get another 10 points for the Blue Alliance. Winning by a score of 182 to 156, the Blue Alliance.